All right. Now it's time to explore your customization options. So Salesforce in itself is highly customizable. So anything in Salesforce you can customize. So it's pretty much possible for you to create or customize any process to suit your nonprofit organization's needs. All right. So what can you customize? Pretty much everything. You can customize standard objects, add more fields, add validation rules, formula field, processes. You can customize, you know, apps. You can make apps and pretty much anything you you need to do, you can customize. So you can customize standard object that is the objects that came with the Salesforce platform like contacts, accounts, opportunities, um, cases. You can customize that. Or you can also create a new custom object or even custom code to suit your processes. Or you can also install an app from the app exchange or find a partner to, you know, help you with a solution that you need to solve. So that's pretty much it. And you can pretty much customize everything in Salesforce. Let me show you for a quick example here. This is an account object of a nonprofit organization. So these are all custom fields. It doesn't come with Salesforce. As you can see, I created these fields to answer, to give an answer to any questions that we want to have answered. Like if an account has given um, more than once in the past two year, or given once in the past two year, or how many, how many, uh, giving account an account um, gave in the in the past four months giving how the giving interval annually you know the interval and then monthly quarterly semi-annually and then the giving trend annually the giving trend count so you know a particular um, account um do they gave like once a year or once every two year, the pattern, right? And so we can better serve them accordingly. So you can create pretty much, you know, all kinds of custom customization, like custom fields to, to, to help you with your processes, right? Look, if you wanna create your own scoring system, if you want to have your own statuses, what's the, is it a partner? Is it a friend? Um, you know, the rating, if you want to put a rating and, you know, any kind of customization that you would be needing to create, it's possible to do so with Salesforce. Even the total amount of contributions, you can create total international giving. You can create and so on right so let's move back here okay so pretty much um, you can customize anything you need to to do in salesforce so let's do the quiz your organization wants to track three additional pieces of data on grant funders so three additional pieces of data like you just saw on, on our custom fields we have a bunch of additional piece of data that we want to know, right? And then granting priorities according to the information. So amount of annual grant making and whether the funder is a government or a private funder, maybe for us, we want to know if the funder is a partner of us or just a friend. What's the recommended way to do this in NPSP? Attach a spreadsheet. No, that's the old way of doing stuff. Customize the standard account object. Now we're talking, right? 
create a new app no need add that information to a node no we want to customize the standard account object like we actually just saw true or false chances for success increase dramatically for those organizations who use a consulting partner to help them get up and running with salesforce well this is our true story from the previous video right we me myself our organization did use a consulting partner a consulting firm they help us tremendously because when you start you know zero nothing about salesforce right so you would need to know and get somebody who are an expert on salesforce to get you start and running so this is true so all right i'll see you on the next video bada bing bada boom hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the salesforce app exchange and do yourself a favor like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it don't take my word watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself bada bing bada boom Thank <laughs> you.